Hey everyone, this is Prince Watercrest, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Bomberman for the Super Nintendo Entertainment System. In the last video, we played through Stage 3, and Chase, who apparently seems to be the main antagonist for this game, to Stage 4, which is where we are now. Stage 4 has you fighting a lot of enemies that you've seen before. We have the red and the black variety of the bomb enemies, and we have to remember that just like with the bombs that we have now, the red bombs can explode through stop blocks. We also have the tanks, which take multiple hits to kill, but can also give us a lot of points. And now that we've gotten that taken care of, and we know what we're up against, let's just go ahead and get this over with, finally. And let's make sure that we can blow everything up. As we do all this, I want to make sure that I get rid of the bombs first. And then take care of the tanks. And then we can go ahead and look for power ups. Once I somehow save myself from getting blown up like I have. And there is no way for me to not blow the two soft blocks near the exit tile up without hitting the exit tile. So I'm just going to get this one that's down here and leave. And there's nothing else to get, so let's just do that. Let's just get the foot stage 4 too. And we have some new enemies here, as well as some returning ones. The blobs are back. The blue and yellow guys from round one are back. Yeah, these guys are back too. Which I like. We have the ability to go through walls again, or at least the soft blocks if we need it. And from here, we can go hunting for the exit tile, which is right there amazingly. And that blew it up. Wonderful. Well, at least it wasn't a bomb enemy. So at least we have that going for us, which is nice. And let's see here. Yeah, let's just go over there and blow everything up, just in case we find some power-ups, which we don't. And now it's time for 4-3. Excuse me if I move while I try to do things here. That was not my idea of a fun time. So you're probably wondering why I just kept my mouth shut and just moved all the way around over there. And that's because the coin enemies show up in this stage and they are very fast and they try to ambush you as soon as you get in here and they are really, really nasty and I hate them and I wish they weren't in this game. Seriously. But at least we have some of another more pleasant enemy to deal with that is also returning and that is the UFO which sends them I, I think it tends to follow you around, I'm not quite sure, but at least it takes two hits to kill, and it's not as annoying as the coin enemy, even though the coin enemy only takes one hit to kill. And we have a kick ability again. I'll gladly take it. I will gladly blow this thing up. Assuming that I don't ruin anything else that I'm trying to do. And there's nothing else here. I don't want to blow that stop block up because I know I'm going to hit the exit tile. So let's just go to 4-4. Four, four. I'm going to pause real quick. Okay. I thought there were coin enemies here, but no. We do have a new enemy here. These little gray guys with the yellow copter heads. They can move around very quickly and I believe they do take multiple hits to kill. Like I said, very fast. And I want to make sure that I take care of myself as much as I can here. And also open things up for myself as I do things as well. 
And also, you know, try not to ruin things for myself at the same time. Want to make sure I get them out of the way. Blow them up. There we go. I'd rather just stay out of the way here. Awesome. Blow these up. And we're done here. Now it's on to stage 4-5. Okay, we just have bombs and copters. That's okay. That is perfectly okay. And I'm going to be pretty conservative with what I'm going to do here. So that way, these guys don't come at me. And that's one guy out of my way. There's an extra life. Want to make sure I get rid of these guys as quickly as possible. And wow, I really have some range on my bombs, don't I? And we can get plenty of time around here. Want to make sure that I make the most of it. And that can't hurt anybody or anything, so... Let's make sure that it... doesn't as we also do that to ourselves. I forgot that the exit tile was right there. That is on me. But they seem to be going in a rather easy direction to figure out. Which is fine. Totally fine. Can I destroy this thing yet? No. I guess not. Now we can. And we got an extra life out of that. So, now that that's over, let's go ahead and go to the next stage, which is 4-6. Coins! At least I'm invisible at the beginning of a stage. I'm always invincible at the beginning of a stage. And I'm able to go through things. Whew. Well, at least we got rid of all those guys. That helps. And we just have the little blue and yellow guys to take care of now. That's it. Really had to be on the move there. To ensure that I didn't do anything dumb. And can I hide here? I'm pretty sure I can hide here. I can. And I can blow everything up and find nothing. 4-7! Coins! I do not like coins! But at least we got rid of almost all the enemies, so that's cool. I'm just gonna kick a bomb into you and you're done. Alright. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, I'll just do it right here. Okay, there's the exit tile. There's that. There's that. Let's get in here. And 4-8, which is a very simple yet also fun boss. So this guy, he just moves around the room. And you have to hit him with your bombs. But that's not enough. You have to knock him into the electrical barriers that are located around the room. If you can do that, 
multiple times, hopefully without hurting yourself, you'll have a fun time. Also, power-ups will show up as you do this, but you also want to watch where you're going. <laughs> I took this guy out faster than I thought I would. Wow. But yeah, power-ups do show up in regular intervals, so if you need power-ups, you can get them here, which is nice. And we've now chased this guy over to stage five. That was quick. I've only been playing for less than 11 minutes. And as soon as we get in here, we now have a captive audience who now want us to fight to the death with this evil white bomber man. I don't know why I went to the right there, but I thought it was a good idea. It wasn't. But we will be going through stage five in the next video. So join me next time where we go through stage five. Until then, this is Prince Watercrass. Take care, stay safe, and thanks for watching!